it's cold and miserable out here. And I just hiked back to the spot where I, um, I, I did a little camp a year or two ago. So I've got my little platform still here. So I'm gonna sit down and just make myself a cup of coffee and get warmed up a little bit. I'm gonna try out a new stove today. I got this little Optimus Crux. And I've got this aluminum cup and water bottle I got from Oregon Mike. And this thing's just been really handy. The water bottle, it's some kind of, a, I think, British military or something like that, but the water bottle nests nicely in the cup and I got a little metal cup. So I'm gonna try out this Optimus Crux stove and see if I can just heat up a little cup of water and have a nice little cup of coffee. This is the entire stove right here. What's cool about this is it nests right in the bottom of one of these uh, isobutane propane canisters. So the stove sits inside this little pouch and this is all it consists of. It's easy to light, puts off some nice heat. Really easy to adjust the flame all the way down to a very fine simmer. So that boiled that little cup of water in about just, just under two minutes. I think this is going to be a pretty cool little kit. I think for the most part, I'll probably put it in uh, my little truck kit, my food box in my truck, just because it'll be a little quicker than the Whisper Light to get out, get started. But I have to be honest with you, it also was really handy for just throwing in my day pack for this little hike. Guys, I'm all jacked up on caffeine. I got my Starbucks V in me and I'm ready to start heading back. It is getting a little bit late. I don't know if you guys can tell the light's starting to fail. So I pulled my Surefire light out of my pack and I'm gonna stick it in my pocket here so it's handy. Got warmed up. As you can see, it's cold and snowing and raining and everything else out here. So um, it should be a nice little hike back to my vehicle, but I appreciate you guys watching. Coyote works out. cabin out here. Looks like this thing's seen better days though. Probably an old trapper's cabin or maybe an old miner's cabin or something. I picked this up from Country Road Outfitters which is a online seller of outdoor gear that I found. I've talked to the owner now a couple of times, Nick. He's got a good selection of gear, plus Nick's an outdoor guy too. So um, if you're looking for just little outdoor gear all the way up to rangefinders, scopes, 
look up Country Road Outfitters and um, see if they see if they have what you need.